Hi everyone, my name is Santana and I help run the Lego Therapy Playgroup with Dr. Shannon Leinhardt. And today I'm going to go over a few simple tips when playing Legos at home with your children and your loved ones. Tip one is to let your child pick the Lego set that they want to build with you. So it can be something as easy as one of these Duplo sets or something as complicated as building one of these car sets. Tip number two is to describe the roles that each person will be taking on. There are three roles, the engineer, the parts supplier, and the builder. The engineer describes each Lego piece using the booklet provided by the Lego set. They then tell the builder where to put the piece. The part supplier finds the piece that the engineer describes and then gives it to the builder. The builder then gets the pieces from the part supplier and listens to the engineer on where to put the piece. Tip number three is to ask questions. If you are the part supplier and you're having a hard time finding the piece that the engineer described, you can always ask them a question like, what color was the piece? How many bumps does it have? Is it thin or is it thick? Is it shaped as a square, a circle, a rectangle? Or what does it look like? What does it remind you of? If you get really stuck, you can always ask the engineer to show you the piece in the booklet, or you can ask them to point in the direction of where they see the piece. Don't forget to have some fun while building and take pictures of your completed work and tag us so that we can see them. Hope to see you guys at the next LEGO Therapy Playgroup. Bye! Today we will be building a Duplo car set. The first piece we're looking for is red and it has four wheels. It's in the shape of a rectangle. That's it. The second piece we are looking for has two yellow dots, two red stripes, and the letter one on it. That's it. So builder, you're going to take the red piece with the four wheels on it. And you're going to take the white piece that has the two red stripes, the two yellow dots, and a number one in a blue circle. You're going to pick a side of the car. Yeah, that's a good side. And you're going to place that white piece on top of that. And you're actually going to scoot it up a little, just like that. Perfect. Don't forget, after a couple of turns, to switch rolls. 